Hey my friends, welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna be decorating for Easter, but I need to go ahead and put our dessert in the oven so that it can get cooled for dinner. After dinner we'll have it. Um, so recently in a vlog I shared an angel food cake with, I used a can of strawberry pie filling. And so this time I'm gonna try it with lemon. I read that it's kind of like a lemon bar and it's just two simple ingredients. You just uh, beat it together. You don't need to add water or anything like that. And I'm gonna cook it at 350 for probably 30 to 40 minutes. I'm just gonna to have to watch it, but I will let you know how long it takes. But I'm also probably not gonna use this whole thing. It may be a little big. I, I don't want it to be too, what's the word, dense, I guess. So I want it to be kind of light and spongy. So we'll see, we'll see how much we need. This is 22 ounces, so I'm probably gonna use less. So I set the timer for 40 minutes, so we'll see what it looks like at 40 minutes, but this um, is how much I use. There's probably like a fourth of a can left in there, so we'll see. I don't know. It looked a little, it looked like it wasn't a whole lot, so I don't know. We'll find out. It may be really dense because I didn't put enough of this in, but I've also got dinner in the crock pot. It's the Olive Garden chicken, so that's going to be delicious. Patrick's going to come over tonight for dinner and... He'll taste test my dessert. He, he'll eat anything. So, Also, I painted my birds that in my last video, I stained them and then I painted them. You can see this is a little bit lighter. I just used craft paint for that one and then this is like regular wall paint. It's that icy teal color in my kitchen, but I'm going to um, sand them down, make them look distressed after the paint is totally dry. And then we'll put these, it shouldn't be too much longer, but we'll, I'm um, going to put these up today with my Easter decor. I thought they were so cute. I got that at Hobby Lobby and then Marion made these two, kind of, you know, traced it and made that one. And then we just made it like a little bit bigger and fatter for that one. I thought it was cute. It is such a beautiful spring day. You can hear the yard work being done, birds chirping. It's so pretty. I've got the front porch. The front door open and the back door open. I'm enjoying the cross breeze. Between that, the smell of the fresh spring air and the lemon cake baking and my food in the crock pot. My house is smelling amazing. <laughs> so I just puts me all in the spring mood when I can open my windows or open my doors. It's supposed to be, I think 69 today where we live. It is just perfection. Sunny, partly sunny. There was like some clouds I showed you earlier. Um, building but they just passed on all right so um i kept this in for 40 minutes it's been out for like 30 minutes but it was like raised up and then it sunk down so once it's completely cool i'm going to sprinkle powdered sugar on top and then we'll cut it and see but i think it's a perfect consistency i think it's going to be so good my house smells so good also i realized i forgot to put the parmesan cheese on this so i'm going to put grated parmesan cheese but i also have this so i'm going to put a little bit of this too because i have it I like a little cheese on it. I think it's like that little cheesy crust on the top that is the best. All right, it is later on in the afternoon now, but these are totally dry. I really did a bad job on this one, but I was thinking, well, I'm gonna sand it, it doesn't matter. But it's fine. And then these two, these obviously have like the better paint. So Marion, let me use this. It's 220 grit, but he said if it's too fine, I'll just get something that I guess it's like a lower number. So I'm gonna try and scuff these up a little bit, see what they look like.
This turned out so cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. With the dark stain underneath, it makes so much difference. I used to just try to paint them and sand them, and it just wasn't working. It didn't look right, and then I... It's like I need to stain them first. It does make a big mess, so I need to clean this mess up. And then we're going to decorate some for Easter. I pulled up my spring and Easter bin. I don't have a lot of stuff. I'm not really feeling a lot of it this year, but I do have a few things I want to put up. this last year for my table it was like my centerpiece and then when I put it in the bin I wasn't careful and it was all got all weird looking so I don't know that I can use that this year it's not gonna lay flat got these last year from home goods I think actually Marion picked them out and they have the little green fringe on the bottom how cute is this so put those little towels up this is one of my favorite little signs I got from Hobby Lobby I have some really pretty candle sticks, candle stands. I don't know if I'm gonna use these. I don't have any candles. I have a couple little baskets and some eggs, some carrots. I don't have very many bunnies, but I do have this little glass one. It came from Walmart. And then this one, I don't know. I've had this for years. I'm not sure where he came from. And then I got these last year at this little like bin store. I think I paid a dollar for each of them. They were originally from Target. And I have a couple little wooden cutout bunnies. I just picked this up at Dollar Tree the other day. I was there with my mom. It's just a little, it's all twisted, but it's a little um, banner. I thought I could put that somewhere cute. More carrots, lots of little carrots and eggs. And then I got these at Goodwill. Let me see if I can do this without breaking. I got these a little while back. It was $1.99 for each. How cute are those? Hip and hop. I wanted this one, but I was like, I can't get one and leave the other one. So um, they're such a cute little blue color. So I got those. One other little bunny I forgot about him. And I think he has a, yep, he's got a little mate. So I got those two little bunnies. Another ceramic bird and then this like wire bird. So I guess I have more than I thought. To the moon and back, we had a love like that. Why do I feel like that's slowly fading? We used to be friends, that was way back when You and I, we were a slow burn baby Oh, we were young, so damn naive Looked at the world through rose-colored glasses You had your goals, then you met me Did you let those dreams pass you by? I'm just going to put these down here because they're safe for Paisley to play with and that'll give her something new to play with.
is ready I'm just gonna have it on keep warm and I'll make some egg noodles to put it on top put it on top of and then Patrick will be here in like an hour and a half this is so so good and so easy Marion's downstairs building do you want to go outside do you want to go out we're in and out this is cool totally so I'm gonna put some powdered sugar on it and then I'm just gonna cut a piece we're gonna taste test it Okay, we're gonna try it. It's spongy, it looks so good, it looks so good. 
Okay, it's very good, but it doesn't have much lemon flavor. Maybe I should have put the whole thing. If you're gonna make it, put the whole thing in. It does taste lemony. Not super lemony. It's such a unique texture, I love it. With that angel food cake, it's so spongy and light. Maybe you could add lemon zest. Definitely I'll do that next time, but I will make this again. I think I like this better than the strawberry one. I'm just gonna make some egg noodles, like one and a half when I have Patrick here, I gotta make extra. And then some sweet peas to go with our to go with our chicken that'll go over the pasta and then we'll have that for dessert that's really good i love to do lemony desserts in the spring we ready to come in for the 50th time today in and out in and out it's so pretty ollie my neighbor is finishing his basement so they're barking and all the workers and yeah constantly <laughs> constantly barking There's our dinner, it looks Ooh, delicious. Yeah. There's Patrick's plate and there's Patrick. Hey y'all, I took my hat off, so it's hat, hat <laughs> he has hair. hair. Uh, he has hat hair, they love you. They don't care, they love you. Score! <laughs> and there's your food, we're gonna uh, go eat. Morning has broken, no windows are open. Wanna feel the wind blow through my hair. Which way do I follow? What happens tomorrow? I turn to you and hope you can guide the way. Sometimes I give up, just wanna be on my own. Even in the darkest times, you give me hope. So. There's some uh, tornado warnings watching the weather channel. It is that time of year. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and say goodnight. I have a headache for some reason, so I'm gonna take an Advil and sit down. I literally have all the babies all over the couch. They're just waiting for me, and then Clyde right there. So um, Patrick left. Dinner was delicious. That cake's delicious. Make sure you try that. I'm gonna try it with different ones too. I wanna do like a lemon blueberry. I gotta figure that out. They do have a blueberry pie filling. I might just make it with that and then maybe add like lemon zest or something. That one would be even better with lemon zest in it. Just make it a little bit more lemony and I'll use the whole can next time because that was really good. I really love the spongy consistency of it. It's definitely different than regular cake. So uh, Marion hates cake, but he loves angel food cake. So anyway, fun fact. <laughs> but thanks for hanging out. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.